Morning guys. We're on uh, the Whiskey Chitter River this morning. Gonna try to catch some catfish. Me and a uh, brother-in-law fished the uh, Six Mile River the other day and, and fished a little stretch and, and all we caught was a, a bunch of mud cats. So we did catch a few uh, channel cat and maybe one blue cat, but I'm back today on the Whiskey Chitter. I'm gonna try and see if I can catch some, uh, some, some spotted cat even. I, I got some, uh, some liver. I got some live bait. I got some cut bait. I even got gummy worms. I'm getting desperate. I'm gonna try something. But I always hear everybody catching spotted cat or, or uh, I guess they call spotted cat. I don't know. I never seen one out of here. I never caught one. But I'd love to catch one. But I know I can catch some channel and some blue cat. So anyhow, stay tuned. We'll see what we can do. See what we got here. Oh, I'm gonna get tangled up. Don't get that other line, ain't you? Yeah, that's a nice look. What is that? A channel? If that's a channel cat or a nope, yep, channel cat. Camera got knocked, so I don't know if you guys can see him, but good little fish. Oh, he's pulling. Let's see if we can get this thing. Come on, baby. I can get him through all that trash. There we go. That's a good one. A short good one. Snagged him, didn't I? Well, another good one, guys. I keep hitting my camera whenever I reel. Another channel cat. Be a good spot, guys. I got, I got a hit on both of them. This tree I forgot about. I might have got my liver, but that's all right. I'm in a good spot right here, I believe. Oh, yeah, that's a good fish. Come on, baby, take it. There we go. Oh, he got off. Oh, if he straightened my hook, I'm gonna be mad. Look at that. Look at that. That was a good fish. I'll tell y'all why I use these sorry hooks. Cause he's let me get a bite on that one. These weights. You buy these weights and you lose them because you get tangled up and whenever I got a a hook that'll bend on there and I get hung up, I can just I can pull that hook and straighten it out. The problem is if you don't change the hook, even if you straighten it slightly if you catch a big fish you'll lose it that's not the first time i've made that mistake but i guess i don't learn my lesson apparently this is a new hook on this pole i'm holding here but we're going to replace that hook there and try to get another one going he might have got my bait just stay tuned we're going to catch him okay guys i got him i think i got him back on here i don't know if it's the same one but he's a good one Pull me loose. That's all right. 
can pull me loose for a good fish. I need to set my drag. That's a good one there, guys. Real good one. The channel cat. He swallowed it. Too. No, no, he didn't swallow it. fish fry or a men's get together tonight and I'm gonna fry these fish for those guys so I ain't throwing much back but yep that's a good one another channel thank you Lord I took my bait Again, guys, I normally try to throw some of these smaller ones back when they're not hooked bad. But we, uh, we're having a men's gathering at church tonight, and I told them I'd fry fish, so I got to, I got to hang on to these so I can have something to cook. I have a few we caught from yesterday, some, some catfish, but didn't have enough. I don't know how many people will show up. That's five, that's ten fillets right there. Alright, let's see if we can catch something bigger. We're gonna move down a little bit. Got one, it ain't just barely hit the water. Alright, and some limbs. Here we go. Come on up here to the boat. That might be a pretty good one. Again, as y'all can tell, my drag ain't set. I don't know if it's got some sand in it. Well, I think it's got that big little fish. I'll take it though. Man, they must be just starting to bite good now. This is three fish in the same little spot. I normally don't catch but one and then got to move to another spot. But I will take it. Thank you, Lord. Those men are going to be eating good tonight. Still good. Of course, you see, see all the bent ones in the in the boat. You can't throw those out. No, uh, whatever you do, don't throw a hook into the water because we have canoers and everybody else that comes down and kids swim and you definitely don't want them to get a, a hook in their in their foot. We just gonna get up here. Just a little bit, and we're gonna tie off. Unfortunately, there's somebody's whiskey jug or something. We're gonna pick that up. Try to get rid of some of the trash.
All right, you see that old tree sticking up right there? And that's this is gonna be a good spot. Y'all stay tuned. We're gonna catch one right here. I finally got him. A small one. Bet it's a mud cat. I might be wrong. I hope it's not a mud cat. It don't matter. They taste good too. Yeah, a little mud cat. Oh. Whatever you want to call it, yellow cat. I tell you what, though, they're good eating. They're good eating. We ate some last night. It was very good. And he swallowed the hook, so he's got to go with me anyway. There we go. There we go. He might be tangled up. Hey, that's a nice one. Stay with me, buddy. You ain't hooked very good. Thank you, Lord. Look here, guys. Boy, it's a pretty catfish, ain't it? Just, just hooked. You see that? I always had a good hook on there. And that hook's already. Look at that. So that's about the max I can catch on these hooks. But that's about the size of most of these channel cat anyway in here. Well, they got some they do have some big ones and every now and then I straighten a hook on one. We about got enough, guys. I'm probably fixing a fixing a head back. This has been fun. It's been nice and peaceful. Spent some time with the Lord. There's nothing wrong with that. But, uh, I got a, one or two more spots I'll try on the way back toward the, the truck. Guys, I got the fastest kayak in the world. This baby here is just balanced just right. Watch, I can paddle one time and it really just, it just keeps on moving. If I'm gonna turn it, I can turn it like that. But, uh, got a big fish on the front pulling me, that's what it is. There we go. Let's see if we got him. I bet you money it's a mud cat. I bet you it is. I might be wrong. Yep. That old polywog. It's all right. We'll take it. We'll take it. Got garlic stuck to the side of you. You just had a feast, didn't you, buddy? Number nine. So, I think we're going to call it a day. We got enough fish for the fish fry tonight. All the, all the spots. Let me see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep, nine. 